Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cast off line. Casting off. We're away. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat blood. Good traveling with next time. Corvo. Yes, yes. The pressure was too low. All these new machines are touchy. Just don't do anything crazy. Sokolov's changed everything again, and we don't know what the hydraulics Have you ever met my niece Callista? She's getting more beautiful every year. Hello, sir. Corvo, you're back. Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait! Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, here we go. Follow me, Corvo. Let's go! Come on! While you were gone, Mother seemed very sad. I think she missed you. Let's see if you're still good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide! this time. I'll count to ten. Here? 
The Lord Spymaster is with her, but she's said to show you right in. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. She'll see you at once. Good to have you back, sir. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. Follow me, Captain. What news have you brought? You should leave them alone. Did you see any pirates? I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before, knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards! They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! Emily, get behind me! Thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Emily, protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do, won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Peg him. Final chance, Corvo. 
Sign the confession, and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now, something to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this, even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time. And someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corvo. Guards! Take him back to his cell. You should eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend. I heard you got eaten alive at cards. Please, not now. People are coming to the execution tomorrow. It's on account of Corvo. The one who killed the Empress and abducted her daughter, Emily. You're out. Good for you. So it's Cut some throats. Right. Burn this place Social to the ground. High and mighty. Come see the noble hey, lord protector. Kill a guard for me, dog. will ya? They're as bad as us betting on the dog fights. Attention, the solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews, unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance, with one week's notice. Let me out. I've got three days before they cut my head off. to spit my food. Attention. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only.
to maintenance crews, unless accompanied by an officer of... scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Corvo's execution is tomorrow, right? Yeah, but everything has to be set up today. I can't wait to see his hand roll. Not everyone did, but I really like the Empress. <sighs> Fucking longer do I have to fuck. <laughs> Att 
Attention! Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Someone a widow, damn you! Corvo's execution is tomorrow, get a few more right? they get. Yeah, but everything has to be set up today. I can't wait to see his hand roll. Not everyone did, but I really like the Empress. You should pay. Smell you from here. Attention. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. Gotta flee! 
many people did he kill on his way out of the prison? I guess if you'll kill the Empress, you don't care about it. Guards. Shut up! Look at this stuff. Somebody's been down here. Bottle Street gang, maybe. Watch for booby traps. Could be some down here by the look of it. Good. If we're lucky, one of them will get Corvo. You're afraid of him? He's Sir Conan. It's all merchants and whores down there. Kids like you, you never saw what he was like. I saw him fight three to one in the practice yard. He's a whirlwind. I hope it's me that finds him. I hope it is too. Too far. I don't want to catch the plague, do you? No. Doesn't the elixir prevent it? Maybe. Either way, let's just jump them down there at the rats eat them. Dunwall citizens, the assassin Corvo, responsible for the murder of our fair empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne, has temporarily escaped state custody. Several brave officers of the state are dead by his hand. He is to be captured or killed at any cost.
won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take them out alone. But what if no one from the squad is around? Then try to make a lot of noise when you die. Knock something over if you can. Bastard. Smells like a dead weeper in here. Several brave officers of the state are dead by his hand. Marvel, he is over here. Quickly, I'm a friend. I'm Samuel, and I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here. I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. Closed for business, half the district marked off is dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the warriors. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can.
starting at last, Admiral. He found our man. Even after six... We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes, Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go to... and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Lord Regent has decreed that plague... I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master assassin. happen now the tank of whale oil's run out. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. The oil's unstable. When it explodes, there's a terrible mess. That one is empty. So everyone in the city knows your face, but this mask will mean terror to them. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? See the lens out of the line. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. Life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Sleep well.
Hello, Corvo. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead, her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this I have chosen you, and drawn you into the void. I am the Outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that men call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. Come find me. that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. This place is the end of all things, and the beginning.
seconds, not no centuries. centuries. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest. Attention Dunwall citizens, be advised, the river crust infestation has spread downriver, as far as the river mouth and flooded district. Do not attempt to approach or destroy a river crust. Any items recovered from doing so are considered state property. Elementary songs, history of the Isles, geography of the Isles, the seven strictures, litany of the white cliff, 
sayings of the overseer. One day we'll get a few new ones. Should I clear space for Samuel then? If you like, but he won't use it. Why? He can't sleep in regular beds anymore, or that's what he says. Says he was in the Navy too long. Can you believe it? Oh. That pile of wood out? Good day, Master Corvo. Spy's stepmother at last departed, and Pendleton Hall was again quiet, although father had this by then happen. sunk Stop into it. deep depression. It was at this sensitive time that Waverly Boyle first... Attention, citizens of Dunwall. The old port district has been added to the evacuation list. The Weeper count for the month of seeds has increased. The Lord Regent has decreed that plague ordinances will remain in effect through the month of rain. Stay alert and stay loyal. Happen. Stop it. Well, let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business, but sometimes good men have to do bad things to make the world right. Our purpose is clear. 
We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Tonight, High Overseer Campbell dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. Your exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical, assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. Another thing. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of... And if you manage to find him, give him whatever help you can. He's a master strategist, and he got caught working for our cause. It'd be good to have him back here at the Hell Pits. Oh, Corvo? If you've a moment. Part of the soul live in the heart? If the heart keeps beating, does that mean that the spirit is never released into oblivion? I can keep a heart beating forever with electricity, but what does that mean for any essence trapped within? Corvo. Corvo. Hello. I'm Callista. I work here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but this is important. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer. That wretched man. There's really no reason for you to listen to me. But my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man, and my only family. The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison. And I think I know why. My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. Before you became an assassin. Just wandering. Ready to go? Just give the signal. a rough trip. Used to be to go straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. The City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. And there are the real odd birds living on the fringes like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. I don't know which is worse. Just take your pick.
it easy, damn it. Keep them in the boat. Canal's got enough shit in it as it is. Huh? Damn it! Hey! What is it? I think that last one was moving. What? Yeah, the little one. Not possible. I inspected them myself. Keep working. Well, he ain't moving no more. <laughs> the city's dead. We'll make it three more months. One, two, three. Good. Hey. Keep them coming. Please. I'm a bit shaken right now. I saw some terrible things today. Attention, Dunwall citizens. The following businesses have been closed and impounded by the state due to contamination. Barrow's Barbershop and Surgery, the Duke and Dancer Ale House, Merritt's Printing Firm, Pennyworth. Pack and Saddle Emporium, and the Smoke Street Dice Hall. Someone a widow, damn you. Dunwall citizens, this is a special announcement from our honorable Lord Regent. This is the Lord Regent speaking. It is with regret that I announce that my term as Lord Regent has been extended through the month of harvest and potentially beyond. In addition, continuing crisis. the overseers of the Abbey of the Everyman remain in service to the state and are empowered to enforce order whenever and wherever necessary. We owe our thanks to High Overseer Campbell for the generous loan of their services.
Dunwall citizens, this is a special announcement from our honorable Lord Regent. This is the Lord Regent speaking. It is with regret that I announce that my term as Lord Regent has been extended through the month of harvest and potentially beyond. In addition, in this continuing crisis, the overseers of the Abbey of the Everyman remain in service to the state and are empowered to enforce order whenever and wherever necessary. We owe our thanks to High Overseer Campbell for the generous loan of their services. You crazy? They can hear anything. <laughs> Well, is it on? What's it look like? Blow off, Haver. What's going on there?
got you now. What a sight you are in that mask. I know who you are and what you're here to do, and I can help. Second day is Psst, Corvo, it's me, Overseer Martin. What a sight you are in that mask. I know who you. What a sight you are in that mask. I know who you are and what you're here to do. And I can help. Unlock me and I'll buy you a drink in a couple of days. By the void, I'll buy you a hundred drinks. circulation and I seem to have forgotten my mittens so I'd appreciate it if you could release me or at least go gather some firewood <sighs> feels good to stand up straight <sighs> thank you Corvo what you're here to do tonight is of the highest importance we've got to find Emily so kill Campbell, and make it quick. Once it's done, search his body for the journal, his notorious black book, and get out of there. Campbell is meeting with a guard named Kerr now, and word from my informant is that Campbell is going to poison him. Maybe you can use that to your advantage. All right, I won't be of any help here, so I'll make my own way back to the Hound Pits pub. If I see Samuel the Boatman, I'll tell him to pick you up in the backyard behind the office of the High Overseer. May all the spirits guide you, and may our enemy's head hit the floor without you taking a scratch.
was just reading in the archive about the heretic's brand. It sounds painful. Have you ever seen the ritual? I've never seen the heretic's brand you. One last thing. Disappear. Not on Bottle Street, if what I hear is true. I hear guards can't even walk there at night on a car. Yes. Us in here. I've told you a hundred times. Campbell is upstairs meeting with the captain of the watch. He'll be busy for hours. Now keep looking. And I've told you a hundred times, Archer, that I am certain he keeps the black book on his person at all. We went to the trouble of breaking it. It's not worth it. I won't continue.
outsider himself has these five attributes by which he hopes to defeat the righteous. What the? Outsider himself has these five attributes by which he hopes to defeat the righteous. He is patient, for he waits every hour and every of our lives for a moment of weakness or carelessness that he may enter our hearts. He is suffering, for many do his work and know it not. He is strong, and only by utmost striving can he be resisted. He is various. For there are seven gates by which he may enter a man's heart, and seventy kinds of spirits which live in the arts and tricks are without number. But he has lived long ages before we are born. The watch is having trouble holding the side streets. Bunch of children playing games, that's all it is. Good, good. And your niece, Callista, isn't it? I'm very concerned about her. She'll be found. My men are searching.
The poor girl. Callista's a resourceful one. Probably found a safe place to hole up in all this chaos. If my overseers hear any word, I'll come straight to you. Time for drinks. I hope you won't refuse. It'll make this business pass off the quicker. Did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. Search the place top to bottom. And nothing to eat but the swill Back we to the beginning. It was Martin's plot to break him out of Cold Ridge Prison. That's clear enough. But why Corvo? The one man feared throughout the Empire. He's as bloody-minded as they say. Left a trail. If he dodged the axe, we can't rule like black magic. Maybe the outsider was watching. Will you have wine? It's a guard. You me. Who are you? Strict. The poor girl. Callista's a resourceful one. Probably found a safe place to hole up in all this chaos. If my overseers hear any, I'll come straight to you. Did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. Search the place top to bottom. Back to the and beginning. nothing to eat but the swill we hand out free. To break him out of Cold Ridge Prison. Did I ever tell you? One but why Corvo? The one man feared throughout the Empire. He's as bloody-minded as they say. Left a trail of bodies. And the way he dodged the axe? We can't rule out black magic. He had help, yes. But how far does it go? The trail goes to Martin. But Martin knows everyone, everywhere. Oh, I agree, I agree. Oh, oh, suddenly this. Will you have wine? I hear you, bastard. Fire will take out his door. Stand clear. Ah! We're not alive. There you go. I need more Watch men. Watch him. Get around.
tonight? You're such a chaffer. <sighs> that might be worth checking. Yesterday she spoke of a wish to read a book. What shall I do? This is very gentle. For such a young lady is easy prey to the outsider. If not already within his grasp, watch her carefully in the sight. She may fall into fits, or be heard speaking to the empty air, or laugh or cry without provocation. Perhaps a Just see what happens if I get another crack at this guy. <sighs> you think you're being God? Come here! <laughs> fools at Coldridge for letting Corvo get away. Who knows what the man could do now? High Remel, the Lord Regent, as he asks us to call him now, seems to have faith in all the Sokolov security devices he's put up all over the city, but I'm not so sure. At least the girl has been moved to a safe place. Visiting her twice a week has given me ample opportunity to inspect the facilities, as they say. So there's an upside, at least. There you are, my sick boy. I'll fetch you. Later tonight. Oh, you know that word, do you?
She's my sister. She's not a witch. Someone get over here. No. Yes. Ah! You appeared as if from nowhere. We would both be dead if not for you. We are forever in your debt. I cannot thank you enough. I must get my sister to safety. But first, I may know of a way to thank you. There's a safe in the bunkhouse. The combination is two, zero, three. Take what you want, and good luck. In the boy. The man you ended was a friend of you, jackass. Please, she's my sister. She's not a witch. I know her. <laughs> you appeared as if from nowhere. We would both be dead if not for you. We are forever in your debt. I cannot thank you enough. I must get my sister to safety. But first, I may know of a way to thank you. There's a safe in the bunkhouse. The combination is two, zero, three. Take what you want, and good luck.
dangerous device, or the mathematical beauty of the music itself. We've seen it in action against the forbidden practice too many times to deny it. But the question no one wishes to ask is, is the incantation itself black magic? The boxes are priceless. Hey, Corvo. It's Samuel. From the way I hear it, Campbell lived a pretty bosh life. Maybe it's not my place to say, but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. You ready to go? Okay, let's go.